Hey guys, what's up? In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how you can make a poll in your Slack workspace really quickly and without any technical skills whatsoever. So then let's get started, guys. So what you want to do is head over to your Slack workspace, select it in the top left corner. And after that, head over to the channel where you'd like to post your uh, poll in. Like, for example, let me go to that channel here. So what you want to do, guys, is add a poll integration or a poll application to your Slack library. To do that, head over to Add Apps here at the bottom of that left panel. Click on it and search the integration or app library here on Slack for any integrations that are related to making polls. For example, guys, if you type in poll, you will see a list of all associated polling integrations down below. So for the sake of this tutorial, I added this integration simple poll here to my library on Slack. You may add any other from that list you like. So let me go, for example, with that one. If you'd like to install it, simply click on that install button here to the right and on the next page, install it from the library, give the permission to access your Slack uh, workspace. And that's basically it. Once the give integration has been added to your library, as you can see, it will appear or be displayed here at the bottom of that list of associated apps inside your workspace. So to start a poll or to make a poll, simply enter the channel you, where you'd like to post your poll in. So let me go with that channel here and type in here in the text box or chat at the bottom, the following command slash, and then use or add the name of the polling integration. In this case here, it is simple poll. Simply select create a poll here, sorry. And that's basically it. After that, you will be redirected to that window here. So here you may add, for example, the question or the topic. So let me add a, a question or topic. Let, let's keep it simple. Uh, survey one, for example, or something like that. And after that, you may add the items or replies below. So for example, option one, let me add one. Option two, you may add also more options or responding options here by clicking on add another option and add as many items to your topic or question or survey or poll as you like. You may also use some of the pre-made templates here in the gallery or library by clicking on that button here, provided of course the given polling integration features such a, such a library of templates. And that's all to it, guys. You may watch it also in the preview if you like the poll by clicking on preview here and go through a short setup. Like, for example, you make, uh, you may make responses anonymous. For example, that's optional. You can enable that feature here inside your poll settings. Allow others to add even more of these items if you like by enabling it here. Show the results of the poll, for example, in real time or keep it hidden and so on and so forth. You may also save the given poll as a draft or send you a test poll. And that's basically it, guys. Once you've done, once you're ready, simply click on preview here. You will see the preview in the following window with, uh, yeah, with preview of your poll like that with these settings. And last but not least, guys, once you're ready to post the given poll, simply click on create poll here to post it in your um, Slack channel, just like that. And that's basically it, guys. That's how we do it. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.